at a lot of amendments to this bill too, Felicia, 63 of them. This is the bill that would send automatic taxpayer refund checks, $225 checks to Hoosiers. That money would be coming from the state's $6.1 billion surplus. And all afternoon today, lawmakers have been trying to get other forms of economic relief into this bill as well. So far, they have gone through more than a dozen of them in the last two hours, most of them filed by Democrats that the Republican majority has voted down. Among them, one would have given an additional $75 tax refund check to veterans, active military members and seniors 65 and older. Other amendments included one that would allocate money to mental health programs for new moms and another that would support more before and after school child care options. And just a few minutes ago, another amendment would have eliminated the sales tax for certain children's items like pacifiers, teething rings and onesies for kids under four. It too was voted down by uh, the Republican majority, Democrats did not hide their frustration even before the vote. Take a listen. The impact of this is not astronomical. And I know where this is going to go. But I just find it so interesting that we can, con as a body in general, continue to say no to the least of these. To the least of these. The Republican majority said over and over this afternoon it's not necessarily that we disagree with these ideas, it's just that they want more time to study them, the impact, and they didn't want to rush it through during a special session. They would have time to actually study it during a longer session next January. Democrats have responded by saying, if not now, when? And the need is now. So the debate continues inside the House as lawmakers over there debate uh, economic relief. They've got several dozen more amendments to consider. It's going to be a long night ahead. Back to okay, you. Okay, Dustin. Yeah.